Hello my friends, today we will learn to obtain comments with YQ Arc Blangon Part 2 to work on AutoCAD in simple and fast way. The first thing you should select the unit. So type YQ units, then click enter. This window will show to us. For example, I will select centimeters, after that click OK. Now let's start. Number 1. To rebuild wall axis, you can do that from WWA command. Just type WWA. After that, click enter. Now select the walls. And click enter. As we see, the axis do it in easy and simple way. Number 2. To draw column for a plan with only click, you can do that from ZZBZ command. So type ZZBZ, after that click enter, and from size you can select the dimension. Click on it, for example type 30 by 30. After that click enter. Now select the first corner and the second corner. And to delete any column, just type EW, click enter, then select the column, for example this, and after that click enter. As we see, the column draw it in easy and fast way. Number 3. To put the dimension to this axis, you can do that from AZH comma. So type AZH. After that, click enter. Now select the axis. Then click enter. As we see, the dimension do it in easy and fast way. Number four. To convert the dimension from centimeter to meter, you can do that from DDM command. So type DDM, click enter, now click on 2 meter. After that, select the dimension and then press enter. As we see, the dimension convert in easy and simple way. To draw corner window, you can do that from WDZ command. So type WDZ, click enter, and from here you can select the style. Click on style. This window will show to us. For example, I will select this. And as we note, we have A and B. From here you can select the dimension for A direction and from here you can select the dimension for B direction. After that click OK. Now click on all. As we see the window do it in professional way. Number 6. To draw trees just with one click you can do that from ZW command. Just type ZW, after that click enter. This window will show to us. Click here, and from here you can select average diameter. I will write 100 centimeters. Then click OK. Now click on viewport and move the mouse. As we see, it's a fantastic way to draw trees. Number 7. To find the area for rooms in a plan, you can do that from MG command. Just type MG, then click enter, and this window will show to us. Click on big point enclosed area. And now, Click inside the room, for example here, and here, and do that for all rooms. As we 
as we see, the area find it in simple and fast way. Number 8. To find area for object, also you can do that from mg command. So type mg, then click enter, and from here select object. Click on it. Now select this object. After that click enter. And uh, to find the total area for all object, just click on viewport. As we see, this is the total area and here it's the area for each one. Really it's fantastic way. Number 9. To draw plan of stairs with one click you can do that from LTG command. So type LTG, click enter and this window will show to us. From here, you can select the properties for stairs. For example, trade widths and landing widths and total widths and step number. When you finish, just click on OK. Then click on left corner to put the plan of the stair. As we see, the plan of stair do it in a professional way. Number 10. To move doors or windows without need to trim walls. You can do that from VX command. Just type VX, then we click enter. And now select the doors or windows. For example, these doors. After that, click enter. And for example, I will move it in this direction to here. As we see, the door move it without any problems. I will do that again for Windows. Just type VX and click Enter. Now select the window, click Enter, then move it. For example, for here. This is our lesson for today. To download YQR plugin, the link in the description. And to know how to work with this command, I explain that with detail in YQR plugin course. Have a nice day and see you later.